Hello vlog fam. Today I thought it would be a great day to clean out the pantry because I haven't cleaned it out in years low-key. I mean I like get rid of things we don't really need kind of as I go but as far as like actually organizing it, cleaning it out, haven't done it in years. So I think it's past time. Subscribe. We're cleaning out the pantry today. And it's not even that it's like a dumpster fire in there. It's just I used to have it so organized and I bought all these containers and that does take a little bit of upkeep and like I said I do clean as I go in there but eventually it just kind of gets unorganized so it just needs like a, a whole once over regage. I also just love hoarding stuff in here. This was a huge selling point for me in this house was this walk-in pantry because I always wanted one and this was my first one I've ever had so look at this storage honey. What pantry has got totally endless storage so much space Lighting is horrible. I'm sorry. You know, things are just like out of place. You see, all this stuff needs to be put away. Why don't we have dessert? Sins need to be rejiged. The chips and all need to be put away. The candy goes up here. It's kind of a mess. Cereal needs to go in the containers. I kind of want to take everything out because I also know these shelves are disgusting. And that's going to be the hard part that's going to overwhelm me. We have to do it, guys. I think we have to do it. Y'all, I found a live creature in here. Our potatoes are growing. Look at this. Coming to life in here. What is going on?
show you guys the pantry empty. We took everything out. Everything except this back corner. And that's because I just organized this corner. So it looks great. Um, but everything else came out down to the very bottom. All empty. And there's a cat in there. But we're about to clean and vacuum all of this disgusting mess. What is fearful is that I gotta go through all of this. Ty's gonna help me. No. <laughs> and we're gonna go through all this and decide what we wanna keep and get rid of, donate, whatever it may be. But this is just too much. And yeah, we gotta, we have a heavy commitment on our hands. This may take me more than one day, so guys. I'm fearful of that. I wanna be done with this today, but I don't know. Cause this overstimulated, overwhelmed. <laughs> She's making a TikTok too. Look at this. Girl, double time. Double dip. Double dip. Please don't fall. Don't dance. Okay. Yeah, I'm in over my head, okay? I want to say that. I was very... I put this off for a long time and I was wondering why. Now I remember. Uh-huh. Um, this is a lot. A lot of work, honey. Do you guys ever clean out your pantries? Because I'm never doing this again. This will be the final time I ever clean out this pantry that we live here. Well, first of all, have you seen this? Uh, you have a turkey down here. I know, it's my girl. She's always what are you doing? with me, you know? What are you doing? What are you doing, Yoshi? Yeah. You're not supposed to be in here. Right, never mind. What do you need? All right, we'll check back in with you. Look who it is. Look who's been recruited. I got all these shelves clean. Look how polished, the, even the drawers, y'all, we got them. This pantry looks so good. He's doing the top round because I can't reach up there and we're pretty sure those have never been cleaned before. Don't mind me using my Christian, Christmas dish. Well, Christian dish. My Christian. <laughs> I'm gonna wash that after we get done. 
But I feel like the shelves need a good coat of soap and hot water. You know what I mean? To get all that dust. Jesus. With my Christian dish. (laughs) And we are giving them. Ooh, it looks so good in here. I can't wait to put this back. This is taking my entire day. Might be two days. I don't know. Decides how fast Tyler cleans these shelves. Um. Three days. Okay. Great.
And for the pantry grand finale tour, we finished it! After two days, eight and a half hours later, the cat's still in the pantry. Let me give you a little pantry tour to show you the finished project. Okay, first off, why do we have so much food? Well, let's talk about it. I have family that comes that I don't show you. My niece comes and sometimes once a week we have like a little party at my house with my friends. So I cook. I also cook like four or five days out of the week. That's when we have food because we eat it. This is our cereal section. Breakfast. Nuts and grains. This is my salad stuff and a lot of this is too. So I wanted it to be close by. This is my noodles that I cook with, pastas, uh, a little macaron in there, ramen. Gotta have a little ramen container. Um, more pastas. These are our sweets. Okay, Tyler already. Can we get this straight? Come on. Oh! This is our candy drawer. Do I put these at the top so we don't reach for them? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Also, I do a food content. So that's what all this is for. My food content on Instagram. These are so delicious. You guys should try these. Chili chews. Oh my gosh. Oh, I just messed all of that up. Uh, cookies. These are sweets. They're pretty lame right now, to be honest with you, because Halloween time, I have all the candy out. These broke my face out, <laughs> so I can't really eat those anymore. So hopefully someone will come eat them. I went with the peanut butter and cheese from Trader Joe's. These are our bars, our nuts, and these are the Chalk Zero low-cal chocolate. And then in here, just breads, snacks, snacks. We have a lot of dried fruit and things like that in that one. Here's like flour and nuts and grains. All the seasonings on the Lazy Susans. Everything's linked down below if you want to get a Lazy Susan. They are amazing. Baking goods. Seasoning. Random baking goods stuff. Tyler stuff. Tyler stuff. Tyler stuff. Crackers. Cooking gear. Cooking gear. Cooking gear. This is just like our sauces, our peanut butters, our seasonings. Same here, hot sauces. And then this is stuff that, actually I need to put this in the fridge right now because we just ran out of mustard. That I transfer over to the fridge once it's opened and we go to use it. This is all of my sesame seed oils, rice vinegars, uh, sunflower seed oils, olive oils, canola. Just all the oils are in here, okay, that I cook with. And then same in here, just ingredients. Okay, we have an, we're an ingredient family. This is Tyler's section where him and his guy is getting here. This has nothing to do with me. I don't even know what's in here. I just asked him to clean it out. This is my, you know, stuff. Extra drinks that we're going to load in the fridge. Cleaning supplies. Nice and organized. I've already messed it up a little bit. It looks good still. And then down here, I made it all seasonal for storage. Like anything seasonal. We have Valentine's. We have Christmas, we have Halloween. I wanted it back here because I'm not using it. Paper towels and just any paperware backups in here. I really cleaned this drawer up. Garlic and onion. I don't even think you're supposed to store those together. I don't know. These are our extra bags and papers. And yeah, this is pretty much it. Oh, up top, we now have empty shelf space, which we used to not have because I got rid of some stuff. But these are just my holiday and like when people come over, we pull down all this stuff whenever we're hosting, which we actually do a lot. So yeah, that's the pantry clean out, baby. We did it. And it looks incredible. The hardest part was the film and like the soot and the disgustingness on each shelf. Some people said that was because of candles. I actually think it's because of cooking. And then this is like all of our glassware and stuff that we don't reach for too often. I just keep that back there, but I'm so proud of how everything came out, you guys. Oh my gosh. The amount of filth we got out of this pantry. Never doing this again. You guys, my friend Z has never been to a pumpkin patch. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. You're going to a good one too. Well, I think it's a good one. We're going to the pumpkin patch. Gabriel's pumpkin, he asked us to pick him out. One. 
blend to paint. Yeah. And we thought this one would be great. Perfect. It matches them very well. Birria tacos. Yeah. Birria. 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 Of course you went for the 51st. Hey. I did. I was like, green is my favorite color, so I was like, Here, get out of here. I got it. I'm chosen by probably look weird. I'm gonna look funny. No, I can't. Can you look funny? Yeah. 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 Yeah
<laughs> Unfortunately, that's wrong, Gabe. Thank God. I feel like. No. Very nice, Tyler. That's right? correct. <laughs> Nice little twenty dollars there. Nice little twenty. Ah, oh, that's wrong. Sorry about that. When you go again? They kept the money in the hand. Wrong. Are you sure? I'm positive. I think I, 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 think I can. I think I can see from back here. I think I'm sure. So I do feel like this is my lucky color. Okay. I'm really lucky. Unfortunately, that's unlucky. That's wrong. You're having too much fun talking to me, and I don't like it. Oh, we have been guests. Well, it was either going to be this one or this one, and since this is taken, I'm putting this here. Congratulations, Z. You are correct. What do I do? Do I take it? You take it, and then you guess again. Guess again. Yes. Oh, baby, this is. Is this 50 50? Z, you are correct. Does that mean I got the next one? Yes. You keep going, and you are correct. Oh, God. Oh, God. You got them all? I got them all. You guys, I made $60. You're lying. You're so out of here. Congratulations, he has won. Oh, yeah. He did tumble everything, though. So. I'm so sorry. Wait, so did I ruin that? I made $20. I did 